Hey there, art enthusiasts. Today I'm diving into the vibrant world of Beijing opera, one of China's most treasured cultural legacies. First off, a little history. Beijing opera, or Jingju, has been around for over 200 years, evolving from earlier forms of Chinese theater. It's a dazzling blend of music, vocal performance, mime, dance, and acrobatics. But what sets it apart are the elaborate costumes and painted faces, each color and design holding deep symbolism. Actors train for years, mastering not just the art of singing, but also the precise movements and gestures. Every flick of a hand, every step, means something. It's like a living, breathing tapestry of Chinese folklore and history. Now let's talk about the characters. There are four main types. Sheng, the male roles, Dan, the female roles, Jing, the painted face roles, and Cho, the clown roles. Each character type has a unique style of performance and specific costumes that tell the audience who they are and what they represent. But what truly captivates me is the music. The orchestra, usually hidden from view, uses traditional Chinese instruments like the jinghu, a high-pitched two-string fiddle, and the pipa, a pear-shaped lute. The music isn't just background, it drives the action and sets the mood. Beijing opera is more than just a performance, it's a cultural experience. It tells stories of ancient heroes, legendary battles, and romantic sagas. It's a window into China's past, showing us values, beliefs, and traditions that have shaped the nation. Sadly, modern times have seen a decline in its popularity. But efforts are being made to keep this art form alive. Schools and institutions are dedicated to training the next generation of performers, ensuring that the legacy of Beijing opera continues. So the next time you have a chance to watch a Beijing opera performance, take it. Immerse yourself in the colors, the music, the emotion. It's not just a show, it's a piece of living history. Thanks for joining me on this cultural journey. If you enjoyed this deep dive into Beijing opera, don't forget to like and subscribe for more explorations into the world of art. Until next time, keep the love for art alive.